Welcome back, everybody, to Cakes Vivarium, episode 14, I believe. Still can't get over these crystal boots. Whoa, 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 what is this? But I use stuff in this go to your... Oh, no. I don't know if that was a friendly pig or, a, uh, or an enemy pig, but all I know is pigs explode. Bad piggy. Wait, I want I want to grab that pork. Give me the pork. There we go. Okay, now I'm I'm confused. What what was this saying? Hi Nathan, sorry. What I do, but I use stuff, and this go to your possession. I use stuff, and this goes to your possession. Huh? I'm confused. Hmm. Okay, I'm not really sure. I did see him or her. Sorry, I don't guess I really know for sure who, which that is. Um, but I saw their name on IRC earlier this morning for about an hour. I guess they must have done that then. Um, I did hop online a little earlier in the week and uh, threw out some threw out some protection blocks just to. Uh, well, I was hoping to keep this from happening, but I guess it still happened. Oh, I see. I see what they mean. the these were in my protection okay and then they couldn't remove them I guess which makes sense it's not gonna let you remove it if it's beyond your point okay so um, actually the reason I threw these protection blocks out was because do cake was telling me that he wanted to throw in the travel net near spawn and have it go to some different people's zoos and stuff. And I was like, you know, that's a great idea. You know, but ooh, the potential downside to that is pretty much what happened right there. Someone coming in and building something and building it closer than I would really like to my base. So, I was like, well, if I throw some protection blocks in, people aren't going to be able to do that. Evidently, I didn't work fast enough, though. So, in this episode, I'm going to look for a bunch of steel, iron, I guess, technically, iron. And I'm going to make it just a bunch more protection blocks. So, for all of those of you who like videos where I am going around exploring, this should be super, super intriguing. For those of you who, have, who hate videos where all I'm doing is running around exploring, um, sorry, I guess. I, I can't make every single person in the entire world happy. It just, it doesn't work. I know, I know, it's horrible. It's horrible. I should try harder. I should do better. Ah, uh, but you know what? It's not worth it. There's, there's no way every single person in the entire world could ever possibly be happy. Not by anything I do, anyway. I'm hearing... Oh, okay. So I was hearing footsteps, but then the little red dot disappeared. That was showing on the map. So maybe it was just a mod. A mob, rather. I should actually go to spawn and go to the public mines. Ooh, hey! Whoa, so dark. There's probably going to be monsters down here. But so much coal. Let's put out a light. Tons of coal. Wow. Well, that's good, because I need the coal to make new torches, because I just used up the last. Um, and I think that's zinc. I, no, that was silver. 
Zinc. I believe we can now use zinc to make a zinc dagger. Which... I forget exactly what that was all about. As strong as a sword, but didn't last as strong as an iron sword, I believe? Finally, a use for zinc. Outside of cheesy armor. That gives you radiation protection, but... I've never been on a server that allowed you to... Oh, no. It actually allowed you to create the nuclear reactors, so it was kind of like, well, you know, whatever. Falling lights. Oh, yeah, I should use that. I, um... I found that the other day when I was doing a little bit of exploring. I just really want that. This falling light. Do Cake uh, demoed it in one of the videos. It's... Oh, okay. That's pretty much what it is. It's a piece of sand that is lit. And when it falls and hits the ground, obviously, it lights the area up. So you can kind of figure out how, how deep a hole is. Whether or not it will be safe to go into the hole. Uh, pretty much just drop light into a lower position than where you are. And, yeah, it's super handy, as you obviously just seen. Okay, well, I think... I think I have no idea how to get out of here. So, just go ahead to spawn. And... Okay, that did not do me any good. Okay, these were going to be changed, I believe, or maybe have already been changed. I guess I don't know 100% for sure. Book with text. Dragon book. Oh. That's kind of cool. Well, I'll put that back. It's kind of telling you about the different... Uh, the different dragons and stuff okay we want to go to the public mines let's go to negative 500 because why not was that already at negative 500 I don't recall being here um, map chunk not generating or I guess it's actually just uh oh but that guy had no problems Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ooh. That might be actually be a spot he'll get stuck. Sweetness. Um I actually need some food. I don't want to eat raw pork chops. Did I put food in here? Whoops. Nah, why mushroom tree sapling? I need to plant me one of those. Whoa, don't want to do that. Okay, you must die. Death to the mobs. So, there we go. Piece of stone. Actually, I need the stone too, so... That's actually not a... Whoa, lava. It's actually not a horrible thing to find. Because I need stone for making the protection blocks. There's another one. And another one. And there's a furnace down there. Well, I'm just gonna... Actually, let me change the mini-map here. To zoom mode. I'm in a large, empty, cavernous space. I have just discovered something yellow right here. Sulfur, I believe. I also seemingly... There we go. Sulfur requires an iron pick, though. And I don't... Ah! I don't have an iron pick. Hmm. This is definitely a... This is definitely an area... Ah! That people have explored pretty thoroughly see a lot of lights going on in here not seeing wow someone left a lot of a giant stack of wood what that's odd 
Oh, come on. Someone strip all the steel out of here? Iron? Iron, rather? It appears that way. And this jumping is killing me. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we can find if I just dig into the wall. And actually... Let me make some more torches right away. Because I'm going to need some light. It's enough. It's more than enough. Okay, let's see about getting out. I don't even know how I got in, honestly. Like, where was my entry point? Where was infill? Because, oh, was it up there? <gasps> Yay! I'm going to break it. Yep. It's fine, though. I got plenty more. No, I don't. I need so much stone. Okay, let's put that someplace safe. Well, whatever. We're just going to dig into this wall. And see where it takes us. Probably nowhere interesting. Going to be a super boring video. I apologize. I guess I could always edit this chunk out. But that's just not the way I operate. Slowly but surely, we move on into the darkness. The only thing letting me know we're moving is the minimap, which every two nodes moves about one pixel. All right, and let's see. Ah, we've actually done a pretty good distance. Found some ores there. Well, that's good. Let's strip those out real quick. Yep, I will take that. Thank you very much. Uh, let's take this coal. Coal is super useful. Need it for everything. This is copper. And I don't know how much use copper has on the server. I know you can mix it with steel to make bronze. And somebody, whoops, was telling me that bronze is really, really useful. It's stronger than steel, I guess. I have, actually, I don't think I've ever made a bronze weapon. So, yeah, that probably makes me a horrible person or something, but it's the truth. I haven't done it. Oh, hey. We're ready to some more iron here beautiful that is marvelous no more right around hmm that's a shame okay how many lumps do I have 10 lumps that'll give me 10 more you know what it's gonna do let's turn minimap back to aerial view run into my liber tree is that how they pronounce it i forget i think that's how it's done liber tree hey let me run to my liber tree real quick and i shall uh i shall concoct some concoctions i honestly don't know what else you would concoct if it wasn't concoctions like can you concoct something if it's not a concoction i don't know in either case, I have some protecting to do. I gotta cook this stuff down though. 64, that's gonna give me 8 more. I'm gonna have 16 steel ingots. It would probably be in my best interest to just make myself a steel pickaxe. You know, like, why not? Why not? What's it gonna hurt? Nothing. Absolutely nothing is what it's gonna hurt. Oh, wait, yeah, that's right, you can't. Okay, so let's put it right there. And then that leaves that open, but I think that block back there will cover that space. Really no idea. I should spend some time and figure out the actual coverage of a protection block. So 
so I can strategically locate them and get the the most bang for my buck, as it were. Eee! Running with the crystal shoes. Okay, so let's put one right there. Boom. Beautiful. I think actually I need to throw one out back by that garden. Speaking of which, that garden needs to be enlarged. Do I have any seeds? If I do, I should plant them. No, no seeds. What a complete and utter disappointment I am. Alright, well we'll make two more protection blocks. And those will both go backside. Do I have any dirt? Oh yeah, lots of dirt. Good, I shall plant that. I don't know what happened there. What? No, no, no! And I have the stone hole. Alright. Let's run around back. I'm gonna have to put a an exit of some sort heading out to get here. Because this is just silly, honestly. I believe we can do... Whoops. We can do four wide. And everything will be watered just fine. And then let's throw... Some blocks there. And here, I think. That should do. Coming back... Blub, 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 blub. And then... This should work fine. I can't see any reason why this wouldn't. Okay. And then I can do... Like, one... Food type per little plot here. And actually, I think I could put a stair going in between them if I really wanted. So I could put some lighting out. But I don't even know if that's necessary. Okay, let's pull this out. Let's throw those couple items up in there. Harvest this. All right, and then what do I have here? Tomatoes? Oh, raspberries? How do you... I don't know. I guess that's how you propagate raspberries. Cool. Excellent. And then what about the carrots? Oh, whoops. Do you, like, just plant the carrot itself? You do. Sweet. Very nice. Uh, I Offhand, I have no idea who gave me these initially. But whomever you were, uh, very much appreciated. I honestly didn't even know that raspberries or carrots were a thing on this server. Pick up the cotton seeds. Come on. Always need that string. Okay, well, for the time being... We're just going to do halvesies. But in the future, it shall be changed. I'll throw a piece of dirt there. Protection block, take the dirt out. Whoops. That protects the whole garden area. Beautiful. And then... Punch, no to protect or use for area check. Oh. Hitting escape and that wouldn't get rid of the f interface there. Little torch to keep some light out here, which I guess really doesn't matter overly much because I'm not creating enough light for the plants to grow, but you know what? It's the thought that counts. And it's actually more so just so I can see out here if I come out to harvest in the dark. 
All right, so that's those. Someone built a, a thing there, which is kind of going to run in the way of my... St I don't understand. How could they do that? I have a block right here. Because it goes right to there. They literally built right to the edge. Sorry what I do, but I use this stuff, and this goes to your possession. I don't... I don't know. I don't know. Whoops. Didn't want to throw that away. All right, well, we're going to end the episode here. Or pretty much here, as soon as I run back. I know these crystal boots are just something else. They make me so speedy. Oh, I didn't get a new picture. I'll do that off camera. Whatever. Not going to waste your guys' time. I will see you next time. Thanks for watching my video. Really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, would you consider giving it a thumbs up? I appreciate all those I can get. I'm on social media, peoples. Follow me. Google+, Twitter, Facebook. I always post all of my videos on those platforms, or links to my videos on those platforms, as soon as they go live. Which this means prior to the release on YouTube. You can watch them before anybody else. You can also visit my website, NathanSalpat.com and see all my videos there. Really nice website, if I do say so myself. I did design it, so I might be a little bit biased, but I still think it's it's decent. If there is a mod you would like me to review, just click on the Request a View button right there. It takes a two-form on my website. You just type in the information, hit the Submit button. I get it. I look at it. Record a review. Post it online. You watch. We all profit. The world's a better place. Yeah, I don't know about that last bit. But, hey, do it anyways. There's You got nothing to lose. I'll catch you next time.